think that's the fun of the city. Um, Real, I have about one minute left, and I was just wondering if there's anything that surprised you the most when you were reading your book, when you were writing your books, uh, that you found the most intriguing about Vegas. Did it change your vision, your view of, of Las Vegas? Um, well, I, I was taking a, I guess I would say, kind of a jaundiced eye look, at, as I said, <laughs> and I was a little bit surprised at how, um, how, how really bad it was, <laughs> <laughs> I have to say. Oh, so okay. I, I, don't, I guess uh, Jack might have the other side on that. No, I, I think the thing that I was most surprised by in my research was the trickle-down effect of the adult uh, image that we have into the community. Bartenders, valet parkers, cab drivers, dropping people off at gentlemen's clubs, clerks in retail stores. They tell me that the strippers and the, and the prostitutes kept them alive during the lull after 9-11. So, like it or not, the money flows all the way through the community, all these thousands of dollars that are generated by the adult industry. So don't thumb your nose at it too much because you're probably indirectly a beneficiary of that new image. Well, hopefully we can all hang in there together and make this a, a continued great city. Uh, I want to thank you both for being here, and I love both of your books, and I hope everybody will get a chance to read them, and I'll look forward to future books. Thank you for joining us at the KLVX-TV Book Club.